Roman history abounds, but there's far more to discover in the boot-shaped country at the bottom of Western Europe. Spend your time chilling on the gorgeous Amalfi Coast, go with the flow in breathtaking Venice, or seek solitude on a long-distance hike through the Dolomites. These are, in no particular order, the things not to miss in Italy. There's so much to see in Rome that aimlessly wandering the city's fantastic old centre can yield a surprise at every turn, whether it's an ancient statue, a marvellous Baroque fountain or a bustling piazza. The ancient theatres at Syracuse and Taormina are magnificent summer stages for Greek drama and the temple complex at nearby Agrigento is one of the best outside Greece. Italian wine is undergoing a resurgence and there's nothing like sampling local varieties in an enoteca or wine bar, accompanied by a plate of regional cheese and cold meats. Picture-perfect Urbino, the so-called ideal city, is one of the most memorable of Italy's provincial cities. Ravenna's Byzantine mosaics in the churches of Santa Polinara Nuovo and San Vitale are a stunning testimony to the city's ranking as the capital of Europe 1500 years ago. Everyone should see the stunning Amalfi Coast, backed by verdant lemon groves, at least once in their life. Crowded or not, the Piazza San Marco in Venice is one of Europe's grandest urban spaces and home to Italy's most exotic cathedral. One of the country's finest and best sighted cathedrals, Orvieto's has a marvellous fresco cycle by Luca Signorelli. Florence's cathedral dome is instantly recognisable and is one of the world's most significant feats of engineering. You can eat pizza all over Italy, but nowhere is it quite as good as in its hometown of Naples. If you can escape the hordes, the Italian lakes are beguiling with stunning scenery and plenty of outdoor activities. Leonardo da Vinci's mural for the refectory wall of Santa Maria delle Grazie, The Last Supper, is one of the world's most resonant images. Don't miss the Uffizi, one of Italy's most celebrated collections of art and Florence's most essential attraction. The artist's frescoes in Padua's Cappella degli Scrovegni constitute one of the great works of European art. Probably the two best preserved Roman sites in the country, destroyed and at the same time preserved by the eruption of Vesuvius in AD 79. There are plenty of places to sun worship in Italy, but Sardinia's coastline ranks among one of the most beautiful. The spiky landscape of the Dolomites is perfect hiking country, covered in dramatic long distance trails. The largest and richest collection of art and culture in the world, you'd be mad to miss the Vatican Museums when in Rome.